Our current snowpack structure is not good and it's unlikely to get better anytime soon. We've got at least two prominent weak layers in our snowpack that formed during the dry spells in mid-November and early December. We're forming another weak layer right now at the surface of the snowpack with this early January drought. These weak layers are really slow to heal and they're going to be with us for the foreseeable future. Depending on where you are in the state, some avalanches are breaking on weak layers in the middle of the snowpack and others are breaking on basal facets closer to the ground. But regardless of where avalanches are failing, they are growing large enough to bury or kill you. It's not unusual for Colorado to have persistent weak layers in our snowpack, but this year is particularly bad. Your usual plan might not be a good one with these current conditions. We're going to have to exercise cautious travel and careful terrain selection for the near future at least. Stay up to date on current conditions by getting the forecast at colorado.gov avalanche or checking the forecast on your mobile device through the CIC phone app.